I am Anil Kumar sharing with you a test question on trigonometry. The question here is, Mario is repairing the wires on a radio broadcast tower. He is in the basket of his repaired truck 40 meters from the tower. When he looks up, he estimates that the angle of elevation to the top of the tower is 42 degrees. When he looks down, he estimates the angle of depression to the bottom of the tower is 32 degrees. How high is the tower to the nearest meter? So I have a rough sketch here to represent this situation. Let's try to label and then answer the question. Uh, let's read it once again. It says, Mario is repairing the wires on a radio broadcast tower. So TO is that tower. He is in the basket of his repair truck. So that is the position of Mario M. Repair truck 40 meters from the tower. That means this distance is 40 meters. So this distance is 40 meters. Let us say that this is MP. That distance is 40 meters. When he looks up, he estimates that the angle of elevation to the top is 42 degrees. So we well, have drawn a smaller angle here, but this angle is actually bigger. It is 42 degrees. So let me write 42 here, right? So that is angle of elevation. Angle of elevation is always with the horizontal. When he looks down, he estimates the angle of depression to the bottom of the tower as 32 degrees. So angle of depression is also with the horizontal, so that is 32 degrees. Right. So these are the angles. Drawing is definitely not to the scale. You need to figure out how high is the tower. That means TO is what you need to find. Correct? So that is the question for you. You can pause the video, answer the question, and then look into my suggestions. Now in this particular situation, we are considering tower at right angles. So this is not a sine law or a cosine law application. This is a right triangle application. Correct? So from here, what you notice is that we have two right triangles. One of them is MTP, so we have triangle MTP, which is the right triangle. Here we can find what TP is, since we know what MP, the distance of Mario from the building, 40 meters. So the ratio which connects TP with the given distance is tan. So we can write down tan of 42 degrees is equals to TP divided by MP, right? So so that is how we can get and from here we can calculate what TP is. So we can write down TP as equals to MP which is 40. So 40 times tan of 42 degrees. Correct? So we can get the height of the building above Mario which is TP. Now let's see the other triangle. So let's analyze the triangle MPO. So in triangle MPO, which is also a right triangle, we say that the tan of 32 degrees is equal to PO divided by MP, right? So PO divided by MP. From here, we can find what PO is. So PO is MP, which is 40. So I'll write 40 times tan of 32 degrees, right? So we know MP uh, let me write, MP is 40, right? 40 meters. So let us use calculator, find both the answers. So first one is 40 into 10, 42. So we get 40, 10, 42. That is equal to 36.01. So let me write down this as 36.01. The other one is 40 times 32, 10, 30, right? So 40, 10, 32 that is equals to 24.9 24.99 so we'll approximate these to let us say 36 and this one to 25 right the question is to nearest meter and that is why we approximated that to these numbers and these numbers are in meters correct so clearly the height of the tower to so height of the tower is 
sum of these two which is TP plus PO which we can write this as 36 plus 25 and that is just add them up so 6 and 5 11 and 61 meters so our answer is that the height of the tower is 61 meters so that is how you can solve it thank you